Ethiopia, the land of our has come out of Egypt. Ethiopia now stretches forth their hands unto God. O thou God of Ethiopia, our divine majesty, thy spirit have come into our heart to dwell into the path of righteousness, Jesus. Help us to forgive that we must be forgiven. Teach us love, loyalty, and earth as it is desired. Endure us with thy wisdom, knowledge, and understanding to do thy will. Thy blessing to you that the hungry be fed, the naked be clothed, the sick be nourished, the aged protected, and the infants cared for. Deliver us from the hands of our enemies that we must be fruitful for this last day. When our enemies are past and decay, in the depths of the sea, in the depths of the earth, or the bowels of the peace, oh, give us all a place in thy kingdom forever. Salam ta. Most people might want to know the occasion. It started long ago. But since 1960, I mean 1958, the universities have made some studies on the movement. Who remember Brother Fox from down here? Was one who took around Professor Simpson in the rural area in Montego Bay. And Professor Simpson make a report on the Rastafari movement. Internationally, if the world wants to know, 1959, about the Rastafari movement. They would have to take Professor Simpson's paper as, as a glimpse of the Rastafari movement. 1959, things happened at Prime, Premier of Jamaica, 
accuses Rastaman of being subversive. And Rastaman didn't have no intention to be any subverse. So we therefore accuse the premier who makes some erroneous statement about Rastaman who take away the government. And charge him with international charges. But our police was not efficient enough to arrest him. Notwithstanding, the university was asked to make a severe movement. Dr. Lewis gave the movement three students to make a research severe and report to him that he make a comprehensive report and report it to government, which is the, his recommendation. So far, the international scene has lost contact at the movement. But outside the inter international world, it is noticed that groups of people in almost every country is adapting attitude of this movement. Therefore, it requires a next look at. Columbia University decide to use this summer period to study the movement. Since in May, they kept a conference at the Hilton Hotel about Rasta being group delusion. Some of us attended the conference. The newspaper said they was shocked to find Rasta at that conference. But it was a professional conference and to them Rasta is no professional. But there was psychiatrists at that conference who defend Rasta movement, and they are not Rastas, that the movement is not delirious, is not a mad movement as some people think. For society on a whole have its own delusions that them don't admit. Notwithstanding, it is prophesied that oppression make the wise man mad. And who is madder than my servant, said the Lord, our God, Rastafari. Therefore, therefore, two prophecy, it come to the conclusion that the Rastafarians are a delirious group of people. We're mad. We want to Africa, we call Rastafari God, and more things are it. But if the world should take a look at it and we ask them certain questions like if I have the right to own God, the world will answer me yes. For God is owned by everyone as them father. Yet still wish God is owned by who? Our God Rastafari has proven to the world that there is certain recognition he paid unto us who won him. So therefore, since it is on the dungle, the Honorable Marcus Gave prophesy that this thing shall rise up. And 1960 it was on the dungle. This thing rise up, and 61 it rise and leave and go to Africa. And in 69, when them come back again, to carry the movement a little further. Is the dongle again we come back? We go and read Psalm 9. Those who know it can say. Understanding that this is a coronation psalm. That when His Majesty was crowned 1930, this is what everyone chants. 
I will praise thee, O Lord, with my whole heart. I will show forth all thy marvelous works. I will be glad and rejoice in thee. I will sing praise to thy name, O thou most high. When mine enemies are turned back, they shall fall and perish at thy presence. For thou hast maintained my right and my cause, thou satest in the throne, judging right. Thou hast rebuked the Eden, thou hast destroyed the wicked, thou hast put out their name forever and ever. O thou enemy, destructions are come to a perpetual end, and thou hast destroyed cities, their memorials is perished with them. But the Lord shall endure forever, he hath prepared his throne for judgment. And he shall judge the world in righteousness. He shall minister judgment to the people in uprightness. The Lord all show will be a refuge for the oppressed, a refuge in times of trouble. And they that know thy name, Rastafari, will put their trust in thee. For thou, Lord, hast thou not forsaken them that seek thee. Sing praises to the Lord which dwelleth in Zion, declare among the people his doing. When he maketh the nutrition for blood, he remembereth them. He forgotteth not the cry of the humble. Have mercy upon me, O Lord, consider my troubles which I suffer of them that hate me. Thou art lifted me up from the gates of death, that I may show forth all thy praise in the gates of the daughter of Zion. I will rejoice in thy salvation. The Eden are sunk down in the pit that they made, in the net which they did their own foot take. The Lord is known by the judgment which he executed. The wicked is snared in the works of his own hands, Agiang Sila. The wicked shall be turned into hell on all the nations that forget God. For the needy shall not always be forgotten. The expectation of the poor shall not perish forever. Arise, O Lord, our God, rock. Let not men prevail. Let the heathen be judged in thy sight. Put them in fear, O Lord, our God, rock. That the nations may know themselves.
red, white, and blue.
are programmed and made for your life, Almighty Get your Bible, throw your color, in the Man answer to this call. Oh, you're not.